At 11 a.m. at Autism Compassion Africa at Cape Coast in the Central Region, little Kobe Stax is to wear his T-shirt. It's part of lessons to enable him live independently. After about five minutes, he sails through with some encouragement. Yay! Great work, Kobe! Let's take some biscuits. Kobe is 10 years old and... Um, he was admitted in this institution in 2018. So he came with his diagnosis and then whenever a student gets here, we also do our interview with the parents. We do indirect observation and other assessments for the child to know the strengths, the weaknesses and what we can do to help the child. It's it's not been an easy journey, but his father is proud of the little big steps Kobe's undertaken. I know first I'm going to say my dad, I'm going to say my dad, I'm going to say my dad. He couldn't call the names of his parents, but now he can. He can also eat, grateful for the progress. So remember you are working for? Working for this? Can I hear you in here, Binya? This, they want to say an emergency, dangerous situation, Boza. For behavior technicians here at the Autism Compassion Africa, it takes lots of patience, motivation, and love to support children on the autism spectrum. Pascal is 23 years old now, and we have now started with the transition programs for Pascal now. Before you work with Pascal, you have to trade in something. We have tangibles, like using objects. If you show the objects to him for him to choose from, or you can ask, because it's a vocal kid, you can ask Pascal, what do you want after work? We use it as a reinforcer, or for him uh, to motivate him, or for him to work for a period of time. Children on the autism spectrum must be embraced and encouraged to live an independent life. Hello. Today, Christopher is practicing how to make a phone conversation. Whether it's a child on the spectrum learning how to eat all by themselves or how to identify when to use the washroom or performing simple day-to-day -day tasks, Autism Compassion Africa is helping to provide breakthrough for children with autism and their communities in West Africa through the application of Evidence-Based Applied Behavior Analysis Therapy, ABA. Autism Spectrum Disorder is a neurodevelopmental disorder um, that is characterized by repetitive behavior from social skills deficit as well as some communication deficit and then some behaviors of concern. So a child with autism may be on the spectrum and that means that different kids may be thriving at different areas. So one kid may, may potentially be doing so great at this area once the others may not be doing great at that area by different areas. The matter is verbal. He communicates most of his needs in Fanti. We are having a lot of programs we are doing for him. There's some, like I mentioned, some like brushing of hair, counting, indicating of objects in the environment because he's aging and when he goes out to the environment, he should be able to know that this is what is called maybe door, fan, table, other things. You have to be tolerant, yes. And you are supposed to humble yourself as well. Because if you don't humble yourself, you cannot learn from the, how the kids they do. You are supposed to also play with them so that they can know that as the teacher, he's able to play with me so I can also work with the teacher. What Ghana needs is a social system that provides support for all children with autism as well as their parents. 
Is that the teacher said, Oh, has to pay in fact. I mean, she on the pa. What was some of the cockamine? Because, mind you, I'm a machine, I'm a big brain. And but and I will know better the main tune to ninja. God bless the teachers here. I've lost a lot of things because my son is autistic. I can't abandon him. I have to love him. I've seen changes in his life since he came here. Autism does not define a child. They are so much more than their diagnosis. Being different does not mean being less. And children on the spectrum communicate best when they say nothing at all. I think the education on children with special needs, it's not that quite uh, huge in this country because we've been going out and from even, even the word autism, people don't even understand the word autism. You need to tell them about it. So the government, uh, I, will, I, will, I will just encourage them to at least like help uh, NGOs such as ACE to create more awareness and also provide us with, help us with some of the, maybe some funds so that we can actually get to search people. One thing they would say is that I am not less, I'm just different. So treat me the way you want me to treat you and treat me the way I am. They are so special in their own way. They have so many potentials. So they will tell people how they are and then what potential they have in there and how they want people to show some love and kindness to them. Indeed, little big steps take them a step closer to living an independent life. Porsche Gaboti with the news, Cape Coast, Central Region.